Hey y'all, welcome back to some more Spooktober. Um, and I'm gonna be playing something that's very popular. Uh, it came out a little bit ago. It's been released in chapters now. I'm gonna be playing Poppy Playtime. I'm gonna be doing the Huggy Wuggy part because I don't know if I'm gonna play the other two chapters because it's still technically the same game. So I'm just gonna play the one that's free. Hope y'all enjoy. Um, I've seen people play it, so it's like, I know it's creepy, so we're good. Here we go. By me and my big dumb head. And here we go. Chapter 1. A tight squeeze. As an ex-employee of Playtime Co., you finally return to the factory many, 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 many times days after... <laughs> shut, up, shut the fuck up. I just played this shit. <laughs> uh, so my English language has been very bad today. So uh, it's been rough for you, boy. You are about to see the most incredible doll ever invented. Her name is Poppy, and she is the first truly intelligent doll in the world. A little girl can talk to her. Poppy gives her answers. She is the first doll actually able to have a conversation with a child. Hard to believe? Just watch. Poppy's as lovable as a real girl, and she talks like one, too. Hi, my no, name she, is Poppy. No, she talks. I love you. Like Can you help me polish right? my shoes? Why, of course, Poppy. Just like a real girl, Poppy always wants to look her best. Perfect. Thank you. Her hair is sturdy and won't come out when you brush it, and smells just like a poppy flower. Is there anything else you'd like to say, Poppy? I'm a real girl. Just like you. What's the time? Playtime! And if you've ever wanted to see how all of the nation's favorite toys were created, Playtime Co. is now offering factory tours at just $2.99 a person. An entire yeah. hour in the most magical toy factory on Earth. What are you waiting for? Come visit the factory. We can't... I'm waiting for. <laughs> Fuck you. Uh, have y'all seen Scary Movie One? Uh, it's the part where they're all like coming outside and the teacher's on the top of the the roof, and she just comes out. Cindy comes out screaming, "Dude, that stuff got me." That is easily one of the funniest movies ever made. Everyone thinks the staff disappeared ten years ago. We're still here. Find the flower. Vintage poppy commercial. Ooh. Do y'all know what that thing is sitting on that counter? Probably not. Y'all is too young to know what a VHS is. All right. We are here. Okay. All right, hold on. I want to see. Can you not play with a controller? No. All right, sorry. Pardon me. Pardon me. Oh, it reset it. No, we need here. We want a little 120. There we go. Okay. Oh, yeah. Okay. All right. Well, I guess I actually have to play with freaking pause. Okay. Yeah, I know. I just paused. I know how to pause. Thank you. I got to play with mouse and keyboard. I suck. Lathe Pierre. Clothing. <laughs> Closing. Recording me. So, so. Interact. E. Okay. We're all right. All right. We gotta keep looking. I gotta figure out how to get into there. I definitely think I am gonna turn down the old uh, sensitivity because my goodness. Mouse speed, here we go. Let's turn that down a little bit. There we go. Okay. Oh yeah, that feels much easier to... Yeah, I think I gotta pick this up. How do I get it? Cause yeah, you usually... So these are color-coded tapes and uh, they're pretty rare and hard to find unless like you're a pro gamer like me, then they're easy. And then they go into a very specific uh, VCR and you put it in there, and then you get to watch a commercial or something that like gives you some extra background on. Need to open doors. 
those stupid little hand doom evolver versus but okay all a lot of the same color and from what I'm seeing is I don't think you can hit the same color twice so let's do red Bro gave me tip. He says uh, the train is color coded, so I got to use the colors from the train to open the door. So let's go peep. So I got green, pink, yellow, red. Green, pink, yellow, red. Do I, can I run? No. Okay. Huh? No. Green. Damn you! I was saying, huh? Brother made me forget what it was. Luckily, he remembered. My brain, not good. Mm -hmm. Can't run. What the? Bish! Alright, well, now, there we go. And now we watch commercial. Get those little. There we go. All right, fire left. Okay, here we go. I got the the high five device. All right, too far. But now that I know, I'm gonna get this one because this one is actually gonna be something that. There we go. Go. Hi. My name is Leif Pierre, and I'm the head of innovation here at the Playtime Co. Toy Factory. If you're seeing this, then you're trespassing. Yeah, we play this little tape on loop whenever we close the factory for the day. So, trespasser, just to make you aware, while we pride ourselves primarily on our high-quality toys and excellent child care, we also pride ourselves on our security. For example, this facility is full of hidden motion triggers, which, once set off, we'll turn on the factory's emergency alarms and directly contact the authorities. Oh, and man. that's one of the more tame aspects of our security system. No spoilers. So, you've got my warning. It's not too late to turn around. I just hope that you're certain whatever you're doing is worth it. Well, there's no way to know if it's worth it until we do it, bro. So, it is what it is. All right, so now, we got the the do bobber, so we're gonna go to this other side, and now we're gonna be close enough to shoot. Hold it. Hold, hold, hold. Oh. through. That's where I gotta go, right? Unless it's like another route. Alright, I'll figure it out. Don't worry, guys. I gotta put my thinking cap on. Okay. 
What great, I can't even get past the damn tutorial area. I freaking suck giant forts. Weird, I can't get it to touch again. So I don't think that's what I'm supposed to do. But I feel like after I did that, these were supposed to, you know, let me go through. Dun, 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 dun. Hmm. I'm not supposed to go here. Can you crouch? Is there a crouch button? Uh, move, jump, crouch, control. Okay. Oh, well. Damn, why do I get stuck so easy sometimes? I feel like a weenie. What the hell? Yeah, I feel like what I'm supposed to do is something should be pretty simple, but I am not that smart. <laughs> My whole arm is just stretched. Alright, let's just keep going down. Oh, I can't go in there. There we go. Oh, I did it! Damn. What's up, dog? You mean a half iron? Oh yeah, we gangsta, we blue bros, bro. Huggy Wuggy, 1984. Playtime Co. has designed hundreds of distinct toys, but none connected with people more than that of Huggy Wuggy. Our founder, Elliot Ludwig, Ludwig, aimed to create a toy which could hug you forever. As is always true, Playtime Co.'s four-step process is creating the most lifelike toys was a success. Uh, with a bit of string and polyester, our lovable blue pal Huggy was brought to life. Huggy Wuggy has gone to be Playtime's most popular and best-selling best toy so far. Jesus. Pissing me. Good job, me. We broke the power. Hey, thanks for the key, homie. Appreciate that. Is that for the door? I think it was for the door, but just in case, let's go see anything. Nope, can't go do anything over there. Something's blocking that door. And you can't see a damn thing over here. I need my right hand to do that. Alright, yeah, I think we're just supposed to go through here. Power. Staff only. Does X staff count? I know I'm on the right track, so I have to do this. Maybe I just do it. Okay, there we go. How the hell? Okay, that's all I had to do. Okay, cool. All right, I believe I can just. Huggy has vanished. Make a friend. Oh, I need to make new friends. Did I just see a shadow?
probably check. What was run one more time? <laughs> run, shift, okay. Gotta find an orange tape. quick check down here just to you know make sure I didn't miss anything because like I said if I miss the tapes that's on me a shortcut so if we do find our tape we don't we're not screwed playing with the mouse and keyboard is so different to me this is definitely not what you get used to There's my other hand. Definitely need to obtain. Na, 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 na. That. Okay, I think I need one more, and then I gotta get back up to the conveyor belt platform thingy on top, and then put them all in. And I think I just. I think it's. Oh, maybe it was just the light off of the wall reflecting. Let's just go up there real quick and get these other pieces put into it and then let's try to see if something happens. Okay, so we still need yellow.
Come on. Bro. Go. Oh, there we go. Alright, well, at least I still can't jump. What the hell? Jump. The space. Yeah. Jump, damn it. You dumb doofus. Yeah, I literally can't do anything. literally stuck back here now. I can't move. And I don't believe I've seen anything in here that says <laughs> unstick me. <laughs> uh... Can I pick up the boxes and move them out of my way? Nope. I do believe I think that'll just do it anyway. Sorry y'all. Um technical issue in and I think I'd have to restart everything again because I don't know if the game model okay, hold up. Let me in the background, I'll quit it, I'll go back, see if it'll let me. Let's see, what's my last auto save? I'll keep playing for a minute so we'll get the camera off because I think I actually just found my other thing too no because I already had yellow so I was missing or was I missing green? which one was I missing yellow? I don't remember whatever okay. we got red and blue was up at the top and I pulled that just in case I was gonna keep going Get the hell. Oh, dude, these boxes are insane. Why can't I just kick their asses over? The hell. I don't know, at least I can jump again. somewhere what the hell so yeah it was green that I was missing okay because I still don't see that one again <gasps> damn it I swear I looked up there all right cool well, at least we found them all this time all right God, y'all, I am a noob with this damn mouse and keyboard shit. I do not like it. I hate it. I would rather play with the damn thing. Put the damn thing in. Alright, our second hand is over. Subtitles? Oh, okay. Stupid company knows what they're doing. Oh, I swear, I haven't seen a single box in its place since they started flooding the storehouse with orphanage junk. Right. I get it. It's a nice program and all on brand. But 
<sighs> it's just hard to be happy about it when manufacturing's on our necks about it, because we can't find stupid hockey boxes! Rich. <sighs> You're right. You're right. It's... It's for the orphans. I just wish there were less boxes. Anything less would be more habitable. Is... Is that even a word? Habitable. <laughs> it is to him. He just made it up. He don't give a damn. Okay. So now, we'll go back, open the... Uh, control. What? Free circuit. Oh. Yeah, y'all, I'm I'm sick of getting cooked. My brain is not working the way I need it to to come play puzzle games. I'm I'm out. Love y'all. Thank you so much for watching. I hope you enjoyed at least. Granted, we didn't really see anything scary. The game's not super scary, but it's like it's got a creep vibe to it, in my opinion. That's why I wanted to play it. But yeah, thank you all. Have a fantastic Thursday. Love ya. I'm out.